shares, of course, sinking on news it could soon announce a deal to take over Italian design house Versace. Courtney Reagan has the details on this one. Hi, Courtney. Hi, Sarah. So Michael Kors CEO John Idol has made no secret of the fact he's shopping to add to the company's portfolio after last year's $1.2 billion purchase of Jimmy Choo. CMDC's.com's Lauren Hirsch has confirmed reports that Michael Kors is buying Versace, though no official announcement has yet been made. Kors hasn't responded to our request for comment. Reports suggest that Kors could pay upwards of $2 billion dollars for the Italian fashion house that over the past year or so at least considered going public. The Versace family owns 80 percent of the company. Blackstone owns the remaining 20 percent. If the deal goes through, the Versace family would reportedly remain involved, though unclear to what extent, and Blackstone would exit. Jimmy True was Core's first acquisition in a quest to become, quote, a global luxury fashion group. That's a phrase that Idol used at the time of that deal, noting the company's focus on international fashion luxury. Versace would help Core's get closer to those goals. And then for Versace, there are benefits to being part of a bigger company. Scale could increase the brand's reach, improve the supply chain, lower costs, among other, other things. But core shares are lower on the reports. Wells Fargo analyst Ike Borshaw says shareholders are less than thrilled because the Jimmy Choo deal closed just 11 months ago and hasn't actually been fully integrated to the company. Plus, a Versace deal, the reported price could be dilute of 30 to 40 cents.